Devri Hayamim Shani, 2 Chronicles 1. And Shalomah, the son of David, was strengthened in his kingdom. And Yahuwah Eloheu was with him and magnified him exceedingly. Then Shalomah spoke unto all Yashar'el, to the captains of thousands and of hundreds, and to the judges, and to every governor in all Yashar'el, the chief of the fathers. So Shalomah and all the assembly with him went to the high place that was at Givon, for there was the tabernacle of the assembly of Elohim, which Moshe, the servant of Yahweh, had made in the wilderness. But the ark of Elohim had David brought up from Kiryat Yearim to the place which David had prepared for it, for he had pitched a tent for it at Yerushalayim. Moreover, the brazen altar that Betzal El, the son of Uri, the son of Chori, had made, he put before the tabernacle of Yahuwah and Shalomah, and the assembly sought unto it. And Shalomah went up thither to the brazen altar before Yahuwah, which was at the tabernacle of the assembly, and offered a thousand burnt offerings upon it. In that night did Elohim appear unto Shalomah, and said unto him, Ask what I shall give you. And Shalomah said unto Elohim, You have showed great mercy unto David my father, and have made me to reign in his stead. Now, ya, O Yahuwah Elohim, let your promise unto David my father be established, for you have made me king over a people like the dust of the earth in multitude. Give me now wisdom and knowledge that I may go out and come in before this people, for who can judge at this your people that is so great? And Elohim said to Shalomah, Because this was in your heart, and you have not asked riches, wealth, or honor, nor at the life of your enemies, neither yet have asked long life, but have asked wisdom and knowledge for yourself, that you may judge at my people, over whom I have made you king. Wisdom and knowledge is granted unto you, and I will give you riches and wealth and honor, such as none of the kings have had that have been before you, neither shall there any after you have the like. Then Shalomah came from his journey to the high place that was at Givan, to Yerushalayim, from before the tabernacle of the assembly, and reigned over Yashad'el. And Shalomah gathered chariots and horsemen, and he had a thousand and four hundred chariots and twelve thousand horsemen, which he placed in the chariot cities, and with the king at Yerushalayim. And the king made eth the silver and eth the gold at Yerushalayim, eth as plenteous as stones, and cedar trees made he as the sycamore trees that are in the valley for abundance. And Shalomah had horses brought out of Mitzrayim and linen yarn. The king's merchants received the linen yarn at a price. And they fetched up and brought forth out of Mitzrayim a chariot for six hundred shekels of silver and a horse for a hundred and fifty. And so brought they out horses for all the kings of the Chetim, and for the kings of Aram by their means. <laughs>